That, uh, let's take a look here. We have got some uh, clouds across northern eastern Oklahoma this morning and some gusty winds. Here's the Jinx vicinity. Uh, this is Muskogee, areas to the east. Showers are underway and rain is coming down across east central Oklahoma, the southern sections of the area. Uh, if you're headed to the 4A state championship, so lots of folks from Wagner will travel into central Oklahoma today by the 7, 8, and 9 o'clock time period. So there will be some chances for showers and maybe a rumble of thunder with this. But by the second half of the game, it should start to wind down a little bit. Temperature's going to be in the 50s. So prepare for some showers in the game if you're headed in that direction. Uh, so sunrise this morning was at 715. Sunset tonight will be at 509 p.m. if you're keeping count. And we do anticipate for the evening commute, uh, it's going to have shower and storm activity across northern Oklahoma. High temperatures today, normally we're at 56. So actually, we're, we're, uh, we're going to be where we should be for our daytime high. But it's going to be mostly this morning. By the afternoon, most of us will be in this 53 to 54 degree range because of the shower activity. So here's Glenpool and Coweta and Muskogee and Tahlequah. This is where most of the measurable precipitation right now is located. But we are having to flip the windshield wiper on just a little bit across portions of uh, the broken air vicinity in Coweta. So a little drizzle here and there. But it's mostly right now across the far eastern areas from Tahlequah south to Tenkiller to Keefton to Shakota south to Eufaula and across the McAllister area. Clayton and Wilberton and Salisaw shower activity that is underway. So again, this is where you need the rain gear right now. Areas to the north, Centralia, Bartlesville, Copan, southern Kansas. It's dry now and will be dry for a while longer. It not this afternoon, though, showers and storms will be underway in those areas. So it'll be kind of a gusty wind day and highs in the 50s. So here's the noon hour today. Showers still underway right in this general area, but watch what happens near and after the lunch hour. Scattered showers. This could be the pickup line time. Showers and thunderstorms on both sides of I-40, especially near the Highway 412 corridor. They could have some heavier downpours. Let's let it roll till about the 6 o'clock hour. Scattered showers and storms. Also take note, these showers and storms across the far southern areas, one or two of those may end up having a little bit of hail that could trigger a severe thunderstorm warning. So a storm system such as this one has a lot of dynamic energy, and it'll bring in drier air in the middle part of the atmosphere here. What does that do? It tends to shut down the precipitation. So between 10 and midnight, the storm system itself is moving right over over northern Oklahoma into southern Kansas. Dry air is moving into it and it'll shut it down. So 55 right now, south breeze at 16. Got some gusts around 20 to 25 miles per hour. Temperatures, again, we're not going to change much. We might go up one more degree from what you see here in the metro, and that'll be about it. And then temperatures tomorrow morning will start in the lower 40s in Tulsa. Northwest winds at 10 to 20 miles per hour. And highs tomorrow will only be into the mid and upper 40s, and then the clouds will clear out. Now, if you have a state championship football game tomorrow afternoon or tomorrow night, the only issue is going to be the wind and the temperature. No precipitation. Saturday and Sunday, morning lows 30s. We still think our daytime highs will end up being here from Tulsa South into the lower 60s. The far northern areas will be slightly cooler, some upper 50s. Sunday night, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, we have no major storm system at this point that will be nearby. Uh, the temperature trends still look to be above the seasonal average. So I suppose that would be some good news for folks that want to get the season underway, do a lot of shopping for the early part of next week. That would be somebody that I'm thinking of right now. Anyway.